Unity, Unreal and Godot. Probably if you have been into game development, you have heard one of these names, if not all of them. Well, if you're not satisfied with the status quo of these engines and you want to try something different, I'm gonna present to you in this video three game engines that you probably haven't heard of. But make no mistake, these engines are actually good and are feature packed with a lot of stuff and they're up to date even right now. So if you're interested in learning something new, then you definitely should check out this video. A secret hint, one of them might be a Unity killer. My name is Adrian and welcome to Redefine Game Dev. Let's get started. First is Essential. This game engine is in C++. It features a lot of cool stuff, but it differentiates from Unity and Unreal with a couple of them. It has modern features, which you would expect from a modern engine. Its interface is a little um, from 2000 because the author didn't change it so much. But in terms of what it can actually do, it has some features that Unity and Unreal lack out of the box. These features are the following. First, sync collaboration real time. So if you're working with a friend on a game, and you want to collaborate at the same time on a scene, well, it's kind of impossible without external plugins that you have to pay extra. Well, with Essential, you can start the server and multiple people can join and change that scene in real time. Another one is the fact that with Unity, you can actually decompile games and steal their code. So if you're afraid of someone stealing your code in Unity, well, unfortunately, you have to deal with this because they will and can steal your code if they want to. Essential offers an encryption, so it provides a security layer on top of that. So if you're interested in protecting your code, this is one way to go. Another one is the auto patcher system, which of course you can get from the asset store in Unity case, but well, that costs you extra money and with Essential you can get it for free. So if you're interested in providing patches for the game clients that they have on, on their PCs, then this is a nice solution. Of course, Essential is feature packed with a lot of other different stuff. So if you're interested in that, you should definitely check the link in the description down below. Let's move on to Neo Axis game engine. So what if you want to try something different, but you don't want to move away from C Sharp? Well, I got you covered. Neo Axis offers a C Sharp alternative to Unity. It, it got updated and initially it was paid, but now the developer for some time it offers it for free. Games from Scratch has a review on this game engine. So if you're interested into trying something that is modern and with C Sharp, then you can check Neo Axis. I think this is a solid game engine, it has an interface and has an editor similar to what you would expect from Unity or Unreal and it's quite powerful engine. And lastly, the Unity killer. Well, it's not exactly Unity killer, but it's close. I would say close because the features are really quite similar to Unity's, but it's open source and free. If you like Unity, you like C Sharp, you like the workflows there, but you don't want to be bound by the terms and agreements of Unity, then you should definitely check out Stride Engine. This engine is feature packed with a lot of stuff. It's in C Sharp. If you just look at a glance on their website, it features like nested prefabs, like the interface, the editor. It looks very similar to Unity. But what differentiates this from Unity is the fact that this is entirely free. It also has a launcher. So in terms of the functionality is of course, it's not on par with what Unity can offer entirely. It does offer much more better 3D experience than, for example, Godot, which is a common option if people don't want to stick with Unity because Godot is mostly 2D and, well, in this case, Stride is mostly 3D. So if you're interested in this and you like Unity and you want to try something that's free, completely free, then you should check Stride Engine. I'm curious to see what game engine you like from all of these three. So I'm looking for your answer in the comment section down below. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. My name is Adrian and I'll see you in the next one.